Can you give me an example of a project that you've done that's involved kindness? Yeah, of course. Um, we see PP United as a creative laboratory. We test out new projects in social settings using arts and creativity. Uh, we evaluate those. Some things will go well, some things won't. We try to learn from that and then we hope to give that away so it's a catalyst for other people to learn and understand. Um, the first project we did was called We All Do Good Things and we worked in three primary schools, um, two in Kent and one in Halifax and as I mentioned before that was about celebrating what was good about a community and the, there were a number of things about this project. Uh, there was one about the subject which was about telling those stories, it was, secondly it was about sharing it through the arts but what we wanted to do was work with everyone in that school community. So not just most able or the least able or the most academic or the least, we work with everybody. So we work with every pupil in every year group, we work with every teacher, we work with kitchen staff, we work with governors, we work with every member of that school community. But we also work with parents in the wider community as well. Everybody had a story to tell and we told those stories through um, pictures, we taught it told it through poetry, we worked with the Poet Laureate, we talked it through South African dance, we uh, shared those stories through visual arts and theatre, but also through practical action, that the young people themselves told their stories, but also came up with new ways of bringing that kindness into their local community. So for instance, the school in Halifax, they made smoothies and biscuits for their local fire station. They did peer learning and mentoring and helping sharing games between older and young schools. They made 792 handmade gifts, one for each pupil in their feeder schools who were so chuffed they went and did that in their feeder schools too. So they did lots of what would, could be seen as quite small and naive little things. But they were very valuable things because they had at the heart of heart of that of doing something positive, but also the young people owned those activities. They were their own ideas. And so that ex ex experience gave them confidence and gave them, as these psychologists call it, these psycho these, as psychologists call it, self-efficacy, feeling they could make a difference. And that's, that matters and that's important. And so that, that's what that project did. So that was in the sharing celebrating these positive stories that talked about what makes a good and a kind school ethos but what we did after that is when we wrote that up we tried to understand what worked well and then we gave that away so that um, those lessons went to every primary school across Kent so over 800 schools that again generated lots more activity and we're developing now a website with other lessons and learning that other schools and other people can learn from, but also share and exchange ideas around this area.